Hi everyone, in this video I am going to tell how to implement a BCD to 7 segment display decoder using decoders. Okay, so BCD to 7 segment display. What do you mean by 7 segment? 7 segments are there. Each segment is nothing but an LED which glows when the input passes through to it. Okay, so the corresponding BCD number whatever we are giving BCD is nothing but BCD varies from maximum of 0 to 9. BCD has a variation from 0 to 9. Beyond 9, it is never called as BCD. So, this binary coded decimal number has 0 to 9 inputs and as well as 7 segment display. 7 segment display. As we are having 7 segments to glow, the name is 7 segment display. Okay. So, how, what do you mean by 7 segment display? How it is? This is first segment, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth and seventh. So the segment number is A, B, C, D, E, F and G. And G. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Total 7 segments are there. So, each segment A, B, C, D, E, F, G, all these seven are seven different segments. Okay, A is having some input current and B is having some input current. Likewise, we are having inputs to all these segments so that whenever the current passes through it, automatically the light will go. Light will glow. So, that corresponding number will be displayed. Suppose for this, for example, for example, I want to glow 1, a number 1. So, how to display number 1? So, in order to display number 1, we should take B and C to be activated. B and C to be activated. Whereas, the all the remaining numbers are simply, all the remaining the segments are simply deactivated. That means, they, they will not glow. So, as B and C are glowed, so B and C. Remaining all are not there. So, simply it, it looks like 1. Okay. This type of digit you can see everywhere in your calculator and all normal displays in which now bikes are having displays also with this type of technology, 7 segment displays. We are having the number, big number in front of the bike when uh, it is like a speedometer. Okay. And similarly, if you want to represent 2, so, how it is represented in order to take 2 to be represented, A should be there, B should be there, G, E and D. So, for 2, A, B, G, E and D. So, it is like, like this, A, B, G, E, D. This is what the 2 representation is. Okay, so now how this uh, decoder helping us in order to implement this BCD to 7 segment display. So here we need to consider, okay, uh, let me tell you how the numbers are going to be displayed in this first one, 0, 0, 0 is nothing but all are activated except G except G remaining all are activated and for one A and B A B not nothing but B C B and C are activated B and C are activated and its second one second is A B G E and D A B G E and D. This is what the 2 means. And third one, third one is A, third one is A, B, G, C and D. This is what 3 meant for. So, how many are left? Only these two. These two are not blown. So, the remaining numbers will make you 3. And 4, 4 is nothing but like this. So, this one, this one and 
this one this is what the 4 is and you can take this one also so a b g and f all these are activated and the fifth one is 5 just opposite of the 2 5 this one so this is a sorry this is bc this is bc so a b is not there c d e f and g okay all these numbers are glowed and remaining are not glowed and 6 is nothing but 6 is represented if you have any doubt you can open calculator and see whether these are correct or not okay so this is 6 representation 6 representation a b is not there c d e f g so except that b remaining all are blown here and 7 means this a b and c a b c and 8 8 means all the segments should glow 8 means all the segments of 7 segment display should be blown then only a b c d is fulfilled a b c d e f and g and the last one 9 9 is represented like simply we are having So, 9, A, B, C, D, and 9, this one, and this one. Okay. So, A, B, C, D, E, F, G. So, all this is not one number. By seeing these numbers, you can identify which is number and how to take all these. So, this is A, B, C, D, E, F. So, G is not there except this. This 0 will be fulfilled and this is B and C. This is A, B, G, D, E, F and G. And remaining all are marked here. 3 is nothing but A, B, C and here g okay so now our aim is to implement this particular operation using a decoder then it will be bcd to seven segment display decoder okay so the logic circuit is shown in next slide so how to implement the logic circuit just we need to consider a 4 to 16 decoder logic circuit means we have to consider 4 inputs 4 inputs are there like it is as a why we are taking 4 inputs because the input is a bcd number bcd is nothing but 4 maximum number is 9 9 is represented as 1001 so definitely we should consider a maximum of 4 inputs in the input side so here we have 8421 port with a2 a3 a2 a1 a0 a1 a2 a3 so all a0 a1 a2 a3 all these are 4 bit bcd 4 bit bcd number okay now outputs are a b c D, E, F, G. <coughs> okay, so this is A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. Okay, now take seven segment display here. Seven segment display. Now, as I said, this is A connection. So take this connection and connect over here. Take this B, connect here, C, D, 
D E F and the last one is G okay so this is what the implementation of a BCD to seven segment display BCD to seven segment display and uh, let me tell you the truth table also to get the expressions this is BCD to seven segment display so truth table is truth table is very easy just depending upon the light on and off conditions what I have given here the based on that the corresponding numbers will be activated okay so this is a BCD input BCD inputs as A3 A2 A1 A0 So this is four zeros, zero 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 one, zero zero one zero, zero one zero zero, zero one zero one, zero one one zero, zero triple one, and next one double zero, one triple zero, one zero zero one. Okay, so one zero zero one is nothing but nine. Now we have A, B, C, D, E, F, G and H is, H is not there. Generally, H is also used as a full stop at, after the uh, seven segment display number. <coughs> okay. So as we are not considering it from the beginning, just I am discarding this. Okay. So this is the output seven segment code. Seven segment code. Now, if you look at the representation of a zero, so zero, this is four zeros is nothing but a zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, sorry, something we forgot. Three, three is missing. Zero, zero, one, one. Three, four, five, six, and seven. This is eight and this one is nine. Now, A. In order to represent a zero, see here, in order to represent zero, except G, except G, remaining all are activated. So, except G, so G is zero and remaining all are ones. Remaining all are ones. And coming to this one, for one, only right side pins B and C are activated, remaining all are zeros. 2, 2 is nothing but 2 here, A, B, G, C, D, A, B, G, E, D and these two are zeros and 3, 3 means only these two are gone, so F and E, except F, E, remaining all are ones. So likewise, we have for 4 it is 0, 0, for 4 it is 0, double 1, double 0, double 1 and 5 it is 1, 0, double 1, 1, 0, double 1, 0, double 1 and 6 it is 1, 0, all ones and seven triple one four zeros and for eight it is for eight eight means all ones eight means all are activated because eight should have all segments to be activated to represent that number and nine is E is 0 remaining all are 1s. Okay. So this is the truth table to convert a BCD number into 7 segment display number. 
so once they uh, what is our next task next task is to identify suppose if you are asked to draw the logic circuit for this bcd to seven segment display decoder then you need to consider the expressions for individual segment what is the expression for individual segment a a is expressed as a particular expression that is coming from the k map okay uh, so you have to consider a k map which is a four bit k map four input variable k map because the inputs are four okay but you may have a doubt that in the k map of four bit you should have numbers up to 15 so what about the 10 11 12 13 14 and 15 all these numbers are indicated as don't cares all these all the numbers which are not there in the truth table like 10 11 12 13 14 and 15 all these numbers in the k map should be represented as don't care for all these a to g calculations okay so a is calculated in that way and b b is also mapped all these ones in the k map and then we have to draw, draw the expression so all the total seven equations will come seven boolean expressions will come all these seven simplified boolean expressions are used to implement a logic circuit that is the way of representing a logic circuit okay i will let here for designing for designing a logic circuit for designing a logic circuit Uh, write the simplified equations write the simplified equations for a b c d e f and g okay a b c d e f and g okay right with the help of with the help of k map with the help of k maps okay so totally seven equations we need to obtain after that we have to draw the logic circuit logic circuit see here one more doubt one more doubt is the numbers are available up to nine but what about that uh, what about the numbers uh, after nine they should be represented as don't care so use don't care for 10 11 12 13 14 and 15 14 and 15 because the k map is a four variable k map okay thank you